And as we speak, that rain is heading into the Houston metro area. And we've been out in the storm tracker this morning. Kathy Hernandez has been following on the location of this storm. Where are you now, Kathy? I see the rain coming down pretty hard, though. It is coming down really hard. It actually um, has been slowing down, as Anthony has been saying, and that's exactly what it seems like. We were in the thick of it for quite some time. Let me uh, turn it around for you. We're actually at a red light here. I was hoping to get back up on the freeway, but we had driven so far south that we were ahead of it, so I wanted to show you a more of the worst of it. But let me tell you, we were hitting some patches of high water on some lanes of the freeway. We were on 45 between Conroe and Woodlands going southbound. That is when we saw some high water on the roads. I, we even saw a vehicle pulled over. I hope that they didn't run into some of that water and, and cause some problems for their car. Maybe they were just pulled over to let it pass, but it is really bad. We're seeing a lot of lightning as well. I'm not sure if you can hear it, but we're, see we're hearing thunder as well. Okay, now we're headed <laughs> southbound. We are just on the feeder on uh, 45 here, and this is what you're seeing. There's obviously ponding on the feeder roads, and then when you get on the freeway, it's really difficult to see at times, so that can be difficult um, as you're driving out and headed into, uh, into work or to school. Um, but it is tough, tough to, to see at times, and that's why we're encouraging you especially to slow down if you're on those roads because we hit that water ourselves and it flew up on our windshield, and even uh, my photographer and I got a little worried. I probably got more worried than him, but... Um, so that's what you're seeing out here. You're, it's going to be bad out here. So slow down and stay home if you can, at least for a couple of minutes. Work from home today. Yeah, there you go. There you go. You know, can 20, do it. He says moving at 20 miles an hour, not too bad. If you, mm -hmm. if you can wait it out, it'd be a good thing. But otherwise, slow and steady wins that race. Thank you, Kathy. Y'all be careful. 635 now. Uh,